Well, hi again. Um, today I thought we would um, have some fun by finding things out in nature. But before we do that, I just wanted to touch back on a couple of things from the last time. I did mention that I make covers for my small journals, but I didn't read you the inspirational quote on this one. And since today it's about seeing things, I thought I'd read it. It says, one's destination is never a place, but rather a new way of looking at things. And I share that quote because I think being creative is always about perception, seeing things differently, freshly, thinking outside the box, all that kind of thing requires fresh approaches. Um, and I also wanted to name the two art supplies that I briefly showed yesterday. Um, these are the uh, water-soluble crayons by Caron Dash. I think that's how you pronounce it. And then these are the water-soluble um, uh, oil pastels. And both of these are very fun to work with and easy to control. And you can add water for, for new things to happen. Today was a gorgeous sunny day and Jeff and I decided when we walked the dogs, well, I decided when we walked the dogs um, on Jeff's prompt that we would look for things in the environment that caught our attention. Just sort of similar to what we did with the magazines and collaging. Um, and if you remember back to when you were a child and you may have laid on your back looking up at the clouds passing by and your imagination would create shapes, maybe a castle or a horse or something. And that's kind of the thing that you need to have when you're doing creative process with found things. Your, uh, your focus has to soften and you have to be able to imagine the shape being something else, sort of transform it with your imagination. It's kind of a nice shape. I like the color of this over here. I'm going to grab this. This is another one that kind of looks like hair and I don't know, I like the color, that's all. You saw me pick up this first and I sort of saw this. This is something the gardeners found digging in the garden and to me it sort of looked like an angel with her wings out, with her arms out. Um, I also found some um, mossy stuff. I love this that blows off the trees and I found a stick that also had a shape to me somewhat like a person. And then I wanted some different color and I found this um, barky thing in the um, chips. So to begin with, you're going to want probably cardboard because you're going to use a glue gun because um, glue sticks aren't going to do it. Um, and you can use cardboard again from anything you have in the house that you've cut up. Or if you do have a sketch pad, you can use the cardboard that's the back of that. I also have things that I keep. Um, which come with vegetables. These, I love these kinds of things. And I think today, because I'm using natural things that are kind of dull in color, I'm gonna use a bright background. And just for while I'm playing, I'm gonna lay it down and, and bring things over. Here comes our little angel person. And I'm gonna give her some of this mossy stuff as hair. And this was also in the mossy stuff. I'm gonna put that down here just to make it more interesting. And I have a little stone that I found, a little piece of glass, and I'm gonna put that on there, well, with the glue, glue gun at some point, as a little head. And then this other shape that I found, I'm gonna use that also as a, as a figure. And this uh, barky thing, I'm gonna put on as hair. You might need to look down on this to see what I'm seeing. But here's the person, and she has one arm up. Oh, I have a little seed thing here. I'm going to put another arm up on the it's, other side. It's a eucalyptus leaf. Eucalyptus leaf. leaf. Yeah. Just put that over here. And suddenly the whole thing changes for me. I'm not seeing this as an angel. I'm seeing this as a mother and a child out for a walk. And... I usually have cotton batten around too. I love cotton batten. I may put a little white stuff in her hair to make her older. Maybe she's a grandmother taking her granddaughter out for a walk. But you can see what I'm doing here. I'm just playing and um, might put some more of this stuff on somewhere. Not sure. And then I'm going to glue it down. So anyway, go out and have a nice walk and find some things to play with. See you again. Thank you.